What's up guys, Zach man, doing a little video update, hope everybody had a good Valentine's Day, um, obviously I wasn't, I didn't make any videos yesterday because, you know, I had to spend the special day with the lady, uh, but anyways, uh, so let's get into it, uh, if we're looking at Tron, the chart right here, we kind of, like I said, we've kind of found support, uh, right down here, right around, uh, 645 Satoshis to 650 Satoshis, so, uh, right now we're actually crossing over the 50 day moving average, um, Right here, so if we close above that, we should see hopefully a little bit of a run, and hopefully the 50-day moving average also crosses the 200-day moving average. But uh, I think we finally found a little bit of a support here at the main, like the main main bottom right down here. Uh, if we take a look at the four-hour chart, and actually, if you look right here, uh, we did uh, we are at a lower low, or I'm sorry, higher low right here. So if we can get another higher high, we should uh, see this uptrend starting to form here. So um, hopefully that goes well. Otherwise, if we look at the four hour chart, like I said, this is the major support line right here that we need to uh, not uh, go under. If not, then the next one would be, let's make a line here, would be right here at about 600 Satoshis, give or take. So uh, we need to definitely, definitely beat that support line and, uh, and go up and beat some resistance. But hopefully that goes over well. Now, if you look at uh, Bitcoin right now, we're again we're kind of following the uh, the 200-day moving average right now um, as a support line. Uh, we did have a lower low. We kind of got a higher, not not really, a little bit of a lower high, but uh, hopefully that can kind of turn around too, and we'll get. But as you can kind of see, we've been hitting some lower lows and uh, some lower highs as well. But uh, if we can follow, we can make some support here. We should do all right. As far as major news, nothing too crazy going on. I tried finding some stuff about what happened yesterday as far as the Valentine's Day campaign uh, for Tron, but nothing really popped up yet. So I'll keep an eye on that over the weekend and get back to you guys on Monday. Otherwise, for now, the target, like I said, uh, the buying target right now at Tron is about 2.5 cents. Um, and then the, the first target, obviously, again, is going to be 4 cents. That's what we need to get to. And uh, obviously, the support is at about one cent, and then the bear market target is about uh, 0 0.0052 cents, so or about half a half a penny, basically. So hopefully, it doesn't get that far. But um, like I said, we need to kind of break support. I got a little. I was doing some checking on this uh, P3T thing that uh, I have no idea. Um, somebody commented on it, so I figured I'd check it out. I'm really not understanding it. I guess how it works. I've tried to put some Tron in here but nothing's happening so basically it's a get 3.33 percent of investment each 24 hours forever um so I, like I said I wanted to do like 600 Tron I try clicking on invest but nothing I don't know nothing even pops up so I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or what is happening I don't know but uh I figured I'd give it a go but nothing I don't know I guess I don't understand it how it works I don't know but uh if anybody else knows comment on it let me know what's going on but uh, other than that nothing too exciting uh, as far as major news goes but um, I think Toronto's starting to get a bull run going again so that's actually the only really good exciting news I have which is uh, what we all want you know trying to kind of get that bull run going so all right guys thanks for watching have a great weekend